How goes it? Good afternoon. Good evening. So I'm going to be checking out this new game that just released today. Uh, I don't know how to describe it. It's a base builder tower defense slash FPS. I think you have to kind of do all three at the same time. That's what at least it seems like from the uh, from Steam. I pulled it up today. The devs reached out to me and said, hey, man, why don't you come check out our game? And I said, OK, I'm in the middle of doing a couple of things, but I figured why not? Let's try something new. I, I pulled up the Steam page here and uh, already in the first day, it looks like it has mixed reviews, but it does have 886 reviews. And after reading them, it kind of makes sense why. It looks like this game has a lot of crashes and a lot of bugs already at launch. But uh, I don't know. When it, when a game first launches, I, 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 I always expect that. I mean, I feel like most people kind of expect that now, right? Like it just it's kind of kind of how it works. But uh, I'm going to give it my best shot, man. I'm going to try to see if I can learn how to play it. Yo, long time no see. What's up, Sinners and Saint? Yeah, man. It has been a minute. It, uh, I have been not away. I just haven't posted what I've been working on. I've been working on a video. It's going to be... I have a video releasing before the one that I've really been working on, but it's going to be about an hour and a half, maybe hour and 45 minutes long. It is easily the, 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 the biggest piece of content that I've ever made, ever. It's, it's taking everything out of me. I've been working on it for about a month now, and then I have another one that'll be releasing on Sunday that uh, I've been working on for about a week and a half. And it's, they're both, they're both just like kind of the direction that I, I, I want to head with my channel. And um, I, I've really wanted to kind of mess around with being able to play more variety and, and not just variety, but experiment with some of you have seen my previous videos, like, like the most recent ones that I've done. I've been trying to experiment with storytelling and, uh, kind of adding in that into my gameplay segments. And so that that's what you're probably going to see uh, in the next couple of videos that I'm doing. The cycle has been broken. What are we talking about the cycle for? Every you know what? It's so crazy. No matter how long I've been away from the cycle, people still come in talking about, man, I missed the cycle. I'm just like, it was, it was a great game. And I, and I would love to I would love to see somebody try to take that idea. I wish somebody could buy the IP for the cycle frontier and then just like make it into a game again but make it better maybe without cheaters or less cheaters the frontier was passed yeah man but we're gonna give it a shot it's really interesting i've never seen a game like this before it could be terrible but my guess is based off of all the negative reviews because it has mixed reviews right now but all the negative ones aren't like this game sucks it's a dumb idea blah 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 it's crash games crash and gameplay loop uh, refund because it's unstable like it's all day one launch issues so the idea here is tower defense and then FPS mixed in with that so we're gonna give it a shot before 2 a.m. Yeah, start a new game the graphic settings didn't look it's that over. bad either AI won in the end our pride and avarice was to be our downfall. That's an AI voice, isn't it? Humanity now cowers in the shadow of its own creations. Has to be. There's no way that's Fighting a human. tooth and nail just to survive. Our once proud civilization now in ruins. And freedom seems like a fleeting pipe dream. Okay, if anything, they need to have... I'd like to hear some, like, dark... When synth wave supreme heroes rise up in defiance right in the background not just silence they are the glimmer of hope within the encroaching darkness and i okay. am proud to call them my brothers what's up dag is this pvp i don't think so i don't know honestly it might be i know that you have to build bases and then you have to defend them in fps first person shooter mode uh, but you also have to defend them from AI. I don't, I don't know. I honestly, I know nothing, barely anything about this game. I'll have to look through some of the reviews to see if anybody said. Looks like, uh, ODST. Starfall Project 2077. That's convenient. Cyberpunk 2077. Like, what? that's a, that's a, that's a year that's been used, I feel like, a lot. 
What's up, man? How you doing? Dude, Dusty, I'm honestly, I'm so good. I'm so good right now. I feel great. How are you, Dusty? How's everybody in the chat? Before we get in here and I'm not able to chat as much because I'm playing the game. How, how's your guys' evening going? I know I've been MIA, but I swear to God, it is going to be all worth it. I have a kick-ass couple, let's say two videos, coming up that are going to be start of a new series that I'm doing. And it is unlike anything I've ever done on YouTube. I promise you're going to love it. Oh my God! <laughs> Well, that's it right there. That's where all the negative reviews are coming from. Oh, man. We didn't even get to play. It already kicked me. But I mean, for me to sit there and then, and then just immediately go from, okay, it kicked me. Now I hate this game. Let me go leave a terrible review. I just don't think that's worth it for an, like a, they're an indie team. They, I think this is their first game as far as I know. And it's it's day one of launch, so I mean you're gonna you're gonna have you're gonna have crashes. If you don't expect to have crashes with a brand new indie game, never I mean, not even just indie games, triple A too or quadruple A, uh, like we had with Skull and Bones, then you're 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 uh you're big fat dum dum. You're an idiot. If you think there's not gonna be any crashes on day one. Yo, what's up, Peparo? How you doing, man? It's over. Glad to hear it, Cappy to catch a live stream. Yeah, man. All right, let's try to just end. skip this. Hold F to skip. Yeah, let's just get out of here and maybe it'll let us play. What I'm going to do is also set my... Oh my god, there is a lot of buttons. I'm going to set my... Not audio, but my... Graphic settings lower. And maybe, maybe, maybe that'll make it where I don't crash as much. Definitely no motion blur. Like, every game, can we all agree real quick that every game should automatically come with no motion blur on, and then you can set it on after? I think the majority of gamers don't like having motion blur on, so. Always weird to me. Let's set the te texture quality down to, uh, oh, we'll just put it on medium. Can I change it to medium? Custom, recommended. No, I don't want recommended. Go down to medium. That'll work. Back. Exit. All right. Why is there no sound? Oh, it is too quiet, kids. Hold on. Uh, I think you'd really like playing Death Stranding. Dude, you know, I still haven't played that. I, I've never played Death Stranding. I do need to play it at some point. Background music. Okay, well, let's turn, turn that up a bit, I guess. Okay, audio's out, music time. I'll make my own background music. Head towards target area Z1. Maybe once we get to the next area, once I get to like a save point, I'll just relaunch and see if it brings the sound back into the game. I mean, the graphics don't look bad, right? It's kind of a cool atmosphere. I'm kind of digging the atmosphere. Haha, <laughs> Matthew. I don't look like a Matthew. Actually, yeah, he does look like a Matthew. Target Z1. Okay, C to crouch. Understood. You can slide. Okay. Cool. Let's do that. All right, Apex. Press space when you touch a wall in midair to double jump. Okay. Here is for the Epinata fun. Love the content. Keep it up. Hey, Akuma. Dude, thank you so much for the Empanada fund, man. I swear, I, I, right after this then, right after we get off stream today, the stream's probably only going to be about an hour and a half, two hours again, if you didn't catch it earlier. I The reason I've been MIA, I've been working on a probably hour and a half long video that is just massive. I swear to God, best thing I've ever done. You guys are going to dig it. That'll be coming out in the next two weeks. On Sunday, I will have a uh, a shorter, about a 30 minute video that's kind of like a preamble to uh, to that. I, I it, Nobody's doing anything like this. I pro You're going to dig it and... All, all my time away is going to be worth it, and then this is going to be our new content schedule and path. Hopefully, it becomes something I can get out every Sunday. That's what that's what I'm trying to work on. But uh, after after I get off this stream, we are, I'm going to go get some empanadas. We got whiskey taco down the road, which is a pretty solid. I mean, it's Tex-Mex. It's like white people Mexican food because I live in you know the South. I wish I lived in California still, or at very least had California uh, Mexican food. Because the, the Mexican food here, you know what I mean? Like when it, when they bring white cheese dip out to a table, nothing wrong with that. It's good shit, but it's not real. You know when they do that, that's not it's not legit. 
when you when a white girl is like, hello, what would you would you like to try our cilantro uh al pastor? That's that's usually it's 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 good, but it's it's not the same. It's not the same. Yeah, game is outpost infinity siege. We have it down in the comments. Okay, so we gotta pick up the energy ammo. All right. Bet. And also, uh the game crashed and bugged out the audio. I'm just trying to get to a save point and then I'll, I'll reset the game and hopefully it brings the game audio back. That's why you're listening to lo-fi in the background, which isn't bad. It's kind of chill. Mission report for Operation Starfall. Recovery, deploy OSC near dawn, uh, set up base perimeter. Okay. Because we have to, the idea that we're going to have to do is we have to find a base location, build a base, and then it's tower defense. You're you, like, you have, we'll have a bird's eye view where you can build all your different, uh, defenses, your your offenses, you know, different types of turrets and things like that, traps, and then you go back down in, down, down into your first person mode like this and have to help defend the base that you created. At least that's, it seems like that's the idea. And I don't, I don't, I've never played anything that does this exact concept. I remember I played, uh, does anybody remember Command & Conquer Renegade? It was their first person mode they had, their, their entire game they made. It would have been cool if they made it where you could still have the RTS of Command and Conquer, but then defend those bases by going back and forth between FPS and that. Having something where you could PVP that way, dude, there's just, there's just, there'd be nothing like it. I don't know if you can PVP in this though. All right, there's an unknown beacon, unknown beacon, unknown beacon. We gotta go to all of them. We gotta destroy them. So here's my gun. Oh, okay. I wanna hear what the gun sounds like. So let me, let me see if I can exit to main menu and then come back and get our audio. Hopefully it doesn't reset the whole thing that I just did. Hey, yo, what's up, Vaughn? I missed the cycle. Dude, everybody comes in. Somebody said that like five minutes ago. Came in and told me they missed the cycle. Uh, extraction shooter wise, and if you like, if you enjoyed the cycle wise, I think you're, you're really, really going to like that hour and a half video that I'm creating. See? Sounds back. Okay. So, continue. Please don't make me restart. Please. Please. It's over. AI won. <sighs> well, hopefully the audio doesn't go away this time. I'm gonna run. I can't believe all ten outposts got deployed this time. <laughs> Why does it? I can't believe these apples got to blow up. Why does it sound like that? Cooper, it's been a while. Just try to keep up, Matt. I'll be there when your ass needs to be saved. Hey, you, you, what are you guys doing? You're not talking? You're just chilling in a circle? A little, little circle jerk going on? Looking at the shipping containers? There's a game called Silica. It's just that. Really? It's exactly what I just described. Silica, silica, silica. Wait a second, I remember silica. That looked like Halo, uh, the Halo RTS game they had. The the design of it looked like that. I know what you're talking about. I, almost, I think I almost played that. What happened to that game? Did people still play that? Unknown beacon detected. Requesting instructions. All right, let's pick up our guns. Destroy it. <laughs> He said, unknown beacon detected. Requesting instructions. Destroy it. That's it. <laughs> that's it. That, that's it. Then it just stalled, just hung out there. That's your instructions. Destroy it. All right, this is a semi-auto. All right, I mean, the gunplay's not bad. For an RTS slash FPS shooter. First person shooter shooter. I sh no, too many times. All right, you jump up here? No? Hold on. Get up there, dude. Come on, get up there, dude. Let's go this way. Mission report, more ammo, okay. Maybe it's over these things. That's the way that I just went. That's definitely not it. Oh, it, 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 people are still playing that though? Three out of five. All right. Can I jump up this? No. Dude, how do I get around? All right. You got me. 
You you win game. Where do I go? Tell me where to go. This isn't good. This is I don't like this design at all. It's very confusing to me. Maybe I'm just dumb. It, it wouldn't be surprising. Can I run behind here? No, I can't run behind here. You guys got any ideas? I don't know where to go. Over there? Do, do I have to back out? I just... Hold on, maybe, maybe there's something on this dude's body. Station outpost 9 inside the perimeter extend Promethean Field. The rest of the 9 outposts will place decoys around the base area to draw Mechanos forces. Recall all outposts. Okay, that doesn't tell me how to get out of here though, man. Can I jump this right here? No. Oh wait, do I just shoot him from here? Is that what you want from me? Huh? Okay. That was exactly what it wanted me to do. Heading there now. Um, okay. Wait for further instructions. Explore and collect ammo box. Which is below me. Okay, how? This is an extraction game player too. No, no, Quells, it's not. This is a FPS slash tower defense so i have to find an outpost location I'm, I'm, I'm guessing i'm going through like the prologue right now but after we get out of this uh i have to make my own tower base thing and then build defenses for it and defend it uh by building more to the rts model of it but also jumping back into fps to uh fight off these bots or mechanos as they like to call them we got a lot of extraction shooter stuff coming up in this uh the, the next couple of videos that i'm going to be working on it's not today. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I, this is very, I'm very frustrated right now, guys. I'm not kidding. Exit. Okay. No fall damage. Sweet. All right. Ammo box. While holding tab, use your mouse to select an item and release tab to equip it. Very cool. I wonder what the items are. All right. You want to let me do it? So, sated grip. Grants two stacks of sated when eaten. All right, I don't know what that means. The energy source and ammo box. Okay. Cool. Now what do we do, sir? Head towards the target area Z2. Got it, got it. What's up, bro? What's up, Nolan? How you doing, man? Levi, the what you been up to? Okay. Sure our guys are on full alert. We can handle more than a little hostile firepower. Wait a second. There's there's like an a whole inventory system. I wonder what that's for. To bring maybe to bring back to your base. Honestly, guys, I still have no idea what you do in this game. I don't understand what the goal is. I don't understand what we're where where you're taking the loot that you're putting in your backpack. Maybe it is an extraction shooter. Honestly, I have no I have no idea. The devs sent me a, a key and we're like, check this out. And I'm like, all right, let's go check it out then. B to open your backpack, you can swap it out, drag and double click, and each core gun features its own Zen recipes. Okay, so we have Calvary core gun. What does Zen recipe mean? It uh, enables reloading while sprinting. Okay, let's equip it. Zen to go over the obstacle. Okay. Press 2 to switch to the slingshot Zen. Aim it at the ground to deploy it. Okay. Oh, okay. That might help me out with escaping enemies. Which, which way do you want me to go? Aha, okay. So we got some droids, okay. All right, so now we're going to our outpost, which I imagine is what you're defending and building up. What is a hemp banana? Are, are you asking me? 
what a hemp banana is? Or do you know the answer and you're seeing if I know too? Leave X boost field. Enter X boost field. Which one do you want me to do? Command mode. Okay, this is what I was talking about. So yes, this is our outpost. Now we're going to press M and go into the third person, or not third person, but uh, bird's eye view and be able to see the whole scope of our base that we're building here. Uh, I think there is some extraction elements. Is there Seabron? That's probably why they reached out to me. Because I was wondering, like, some of these companies reach out and I'm like, I don't know why you want me to play your game because our people don't play that. But this seemed interesting. And if it is extraction based, it's going to be way, way, way better. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to be so wet. Select the ammo maker and craft ammo while in command. Can you move? I can't read that. Activate their effects. Begin by manufacturing ammo and activating the outpost turrets. Cool. Uh, so is that ammo? You're not telling me. Dude, well, let's just do this. It looks like ammo. ROS has detected our presence in this area. A mechano strike force is imminent. All outposts, prepare for immediate action. Okay. Get ready to fire at will. It all comes down Left click to, to activate moment. the turret. Fight to the end, for our deeds today shall echo in eternity. How do I, how do I, how do I, how do I scroll around? Oh, okay, WASD. How do I, okay. Push in the middle mouse click and that's how you Pivot, pivot, and then middle mouse up and down to go in and out. Dude, this is kind of cool. For 25 bucks, I mean, so long as they, I mean, I know there's going to be crashing. Everybody's been complaining about it already on uh, the reviews on Steam. But if they fix that, man, and it's going to be 25 bucks, this is a really neat concept. I'm excited to see how, how intense the enemy gets. Also, if they add PvP to something like this, this would be crazy PvP. Going back and forth, trying to fight another player's base. Combat Miner? That sounds cool. Let's activate that. Alright, we activated all the turrets, I think. Or do you gotta left click it and click it on? Oh, I'm an idiot. Don't 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 do what I do. Pay attention. Focus. Those are important things, guys. Have you heard of uh Kingmakers? No, dude. Is that extraction based? I have not heard of that. Deploy the support facility. You can deploy support facilities to strengthen your perimeter. Support facilities can now be built inside your X-Boost field. Let's build an auto turret. Okay. Let's do it. How do, how do I... Is, is it in here? How do I... Is this a right or small artillery form, formation? No. Oh, it has to be. Okay, here we go, guys. Here they come. If we don't make it back, tell your wife I love her. I'm going in. Daddy's going in. Stay here, kids. Oh, they ain't playing, dude. They ain't playing. These aren't as easy as the other ones I was fighting. I think that one has... They're like scorpions, dude. Got grenades? No. Oh my god. We get out of here. They're coming in from a bunch of different angles. Hold on, I'm coming to get them. I'm coming to get them. I wonder if I can hurt my own base. I don't know. Can you repair wall? Detach config? I don't even know. Multiple combat styles. As you progress, you'll unlock new ways to play, including on the fly. I wish, God, that machine gun sound in the background is killing me. Jeez. <laughs> that was driving me nuts. Uh, command mode to command the post. And its support units piloting cataracts. Ca cataphracts. Not the eye thing. Or engaging personally in combat. Okay, so that's that's what I was hoping you could do. So you don't just have to be in the FPS the whole time. You can go back up into the um, RTS bird's eye view, then switch back down so you can kind of have a scope of the whole battle. It's pretty rad. 
Now, how do, how do I do that? Press, I wonder if I just press M or... You know, let's just go back here first. Yep. Okay. How do I repair? I don't think I can. Okay. We need to go. We need to go back down. We gotta. We gotta help these fools out. These these turrets aren't able to get it done. Ooh, I want to be in that. Can I get in that? Uh oh. Oh damn. Oh, damn! Oh, my God, dude! Whoa! Oh, my God, I'm getting overrun. Where are they going? Do we get him? Do I do I shoot this thing? We're getting our asses kicked by unknown hostiles. The commander's wounded. They're disguised as our own. They repeat, they are disguised as our own. Outpost five, emergency Promethean field activate. Oh man, are they are these guys gonna start firing on me now? Because I think that they're mine, but they're actually the, the not mine. And this is just the tutorial, y'all. <laughs> I bet these battles are going to get way bigger and way crazier. Yeah, I could see how this could cause crashing. FPS issues. Once you get so many enemies. I mean, if they have... Like, I mean, look at that. Look at look how many enemies that is. Dude, that's crazy. I don't even know where to go. What are they going for? Are they trying to attack the... I think they're trying to attack my main base. What? How is this game? It's cool so far, man. It's got an interesting concept. Oh, okay, Quells. Yeah, dude, I love RTSs, man. I grew up on those. My dad always played these types of games. My dad had me on Command & Conquer. We do land parties. Hit my dad and my brothers. Uh, Command & Conquer, Age of Empires. Uh... Company of Heroes was a pretty cool World War II one. I like that one a lot. But the fact they're coupling it with the uh, FPS, that's super rad to me. Am I about to get smushed? I think I just got smushed. The AI is supposed to be like this, but they're kind of free will. Okay, okay. Cool. That sounds cool. I mean, yeah, I, I like the vibe so far, guys. I mean, I think that the atmosphere is cool. Uh, I like the futuristic space deal. I like that you can Stop not just build up your base and you don't have to worry about just, you're, you're not just building up your base and then you're having the defense come in and you're just FPS the whole time. You can transfer back and forth to repair things, maybe to add more turrets intermittently and then go back to FPS mode and like try to attack the enemies to help your base defend itself i guess i think that's cool i think it's a real cool uh cool, cool vibe uh 
So yeah, yeah, Javier was talking about silica. So apparently this has been a concept before. I just didn't know that. Main squeeze. Hope all is well. Blaze, it is. It, it, things have been fantastic. Since you guys haven't seen me in a while. Again, I, I've said it a few times, but I will say it once more. Uh, I am working on a massive project. Biggest video that I've ever made. It'll be about an hour and a half long. Um, and it is getting closer. But I do have one releasing this Sunday that's going to be the same vibe of, of that one that I'm working on. It'll just be a lot shorter. It'll be like 30 minutes. But uh, it'll, it'll be interesting. Best stuff I've ever made, period. You're going to like it. All right, let's pick this up. 2083. So this is like six years later. Because the other one was in 2077. Game set reminds me a lot of Kingmaker. supposed to be like, okay. Oh, not again. It's about time. Come on over when you're ready. All right. I just want to skip it. I don't... don't. Cutscenes aren't for me. Never have been. Tactical backpack. Pick up. Okay. Interactive items on the map. Zen firearm. Okay. The casualty report is here. Oh, don't force me to walk. No, I made the wrong decision. I should have went the other way. Yeah, whenever whenever a game like forces you to walk through like a, a short scene, Assassin's Creed kind of always did that for me. I always thought that was kind of silly gameplay. It's like, just let me, just let me go at my normal speed. There's no point in this. I'm busy. I'm still waiting for the shipment. You get to take in the atmosphere, though. I'll give him that. All right. One more Klaus. Have lost your leg. I'd say that's a fair trade for 19 elites. As long as I get to keep. I don't. I didn't know that girls were ever called Klaus. I thought that was like a a, a, a dude. Come dude's in. name. The target area is currently clear of hostile raids. German, Good right? Out there. Damn, my dude got some cakes on him. Uh, hope the little one is doing well. Yeah, man, we're we're in the middle of a lot of big things happening right now. Not just with the channel. I have huge ideas that I think are going to be. I, I swear, I, I I have a, a feeling in my gut. I could be wrong. I've been wrong before, but I think it's going to be the best stuff we've ever made here. Uh, oh, he's a cutie, and. But, but we're also looking like we're going to be making a really big move uh, down south to the southern states. And uh, so we, we got some big, big stuff. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. We're probably going to be getting a much bigger house there. So it, it, it could be a good time. A lot of cool stuff in the future. Always looking ahead. Okay, I like that it's not nighttime now. When it's not nighttime, this atmosphere, the rocks and stuff, this is so much cooler. It kind of reminds me of Helldivers. So, aren't you getting the Helldivers vibe here? Those who stand beside you might be old faces or new arrivals. But in this wretched democracy, we are one of the same. Yeah. Together, we shall march towards the bitter end as brothers. Oh, I don't have to listen to this. Propel humanity to its final triumph. Let our deaths become the ember that ignites the fire. Can't wait to play the game soon. Oh, you getting this too? You can squad up with people, I think, right? If we can, if anybody has this or is going to be getting in this game, come squad up with me while I'm playing tonight. Because I'm curious of how, if that system works. Because people have had crashing issues and bugs, and I'm curious to test out their, their squatting system and if there's, like, how the PvE would even work with other players in this. Like, do you come to my base and help me defend my base, or what's the deal here? Yeah, that's taking way too long. Alright, skip. Go to the terminal. The new and is it open world? Here's the outpost you've been craving. 
yeah, that's what I want to do. I want to go. I want, I want to be in an outpost so I can start building it and gathering materials. I think I guess I got to do to build it bigger. It's time to familiarize yourself with your outpost. Okay. All right. So now we're going to learn about our outpost. All right. No information yet. So this is resources for ammo crates. So do you have to make ammos for the turrets? I think you have to make ammos, ammo for the turrets. Logistics, crucial combat. Oh, or those are for me. It's probably for me. Bulletin. Can I click it? Or do I have to like go up to it? Utility wall. Designed to mount gear. Oh, okay, okay. The all-terrain carrier is the load-bearing section of the outpost. The mechanical legs will carry the outpost on any terrain. For safety reasons, these legs are disabled. While the Promethean field is active. So I it, so it can move itself? Wait, does it like is it like a walker? Oh, that'd be sick, man. If that's how it works. Four tiles make up the majority of the outpost's main structure, supporting weapon systems and shrugging off. Yeah, 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 I just read that. The core tower is the heart of the outpost. The core tower is loaded with an outpost core. It provides power and acts as the control center. The outpost core maintains the Promethean field. Once that's gone, you'll be vaporized. By Game over. Hiatus. Got it. Ammo maker. Okay, so we, here's here's where we can go to craft ammo. So I'll just pick that up. Consumable contains two packs of ammo, a thousand in total. So we're gonna pick that up. Our backpack, I think, is B. Yep. So I, I guess I have to go get resources after we get out of here. We get okay. So there's a leveling system as well. Level one. You change your attributes. You get bonuses, gun performance, mobility. Movement speed, free fire, instant cooldown. So these are like uh, perks and abilities. And you have your buffs because you're within the field. And warm. Resist debuffs from the cold. Okay, so it seems like there's some survival mechanics too. Weird. All right, small generator replaced battery. Okay. How do I... Weapons can be deployed on flat surfaces. You also have one healing station too. To replenish ammunition. Okay. What else do you want to do, dude? All right, so there's some enemies out there. Search for control component. So I have to go search for a control component. Okay, cool. I guess it's not activated yet. Yeah, I'd like to see how this moves, how it packs itself up, and we can move it to different locations. It might just be like a little cinematic, like you say, I want to move it right here, and then it does it on its own, or you might have to physically drive it there. That'd be sick. I think this is probably like the PVE is probably going to be easy for the most part. There might be like some type of dungeon system or, you know, areas where the PVE gets a little bit tougher. But I'm expecting the hardest stuff to come uh, during like the, the base defenses when like big attacks come to you. Uh, yo, yo, yo. Keep up all the great work. Zug, dude. Thanks, man. I do my best, bro. I do my best. I appreciate it. I'll say I haven't seen you in a while, but I mean, I haven't been live in a while. So it's not like it's not your fault. It's not your fault. You ever choke on your spit? Fuck a duck. <clears throat> I can't wait to play the game. So yeah, PC only. This is PC only as far as I know right now. I think it I think it could only run on PC based off of what I've seen so far, man. I, I just saw there were like a thousand enemies coming at my base. Not like sexually, just, you know. Moving towards it. The voice acting, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know what I mean? Like, voice acting, honestly, even graphics, all all that stuff really just doesn't matter. The storyline, to me, it just doesn't matter. As long as the gameplay itself, the gameplay loop of uh, defending a base, going back and forth, building it up, putting all these items in my backpack during this little PvE stuff I'm going searching around, and then taking it back to my base to build my base bigger and get ready for defenses. Uh, as long as that's fun, I, like, I couldn't, you know what I mean? I couldn't care less about voice acting. I don't, I don't care. Ooh. Cryo barrel. Explodes after shooting it. Perfect for a... Don't know now, because it's gone. Oh, I can hit with it too? What, I'm kicking him. Shaw. Sure. I thought I thought I could, like, take it back to my base. I guess I can't, though. 
Some uh, consumable. What is this? Armor plate. Armor plate? What are we in? Cod? Need to pick up plates, bro. What's this game about? Uh, so it's a... In a, I don't care. I don't care what he's saying. Um, it's an FPS slash RTS. So RTS, like if you've ever played Command and Conquer or Age of Empires, you, you have a base that you can go up into a bird's eye view to defend and place down, uh, you know, perimeters and, 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 and walls, defenses, structures. Uh, but you can go back and forth between that during a battle and uh, go into this FPS mode to fight the stuff that's attacking you. But in the meantime, till the attacks happen, you got to go out in the open world, I'm guessing this is, and loot, fill up your backpack, and bring back stuff to build up your base further. It's a really cool concept. I've never, I've never played anything like it before. Have you finally gotten over your sickness that you had for weeks? Yeah, for now, Pete. We'll see how long it lasts. I mean, I sound normal. I, I don't sound like, you know, like... Or whatever it was. Toggle your flashlight with T. Tight. What is that? Zen preset. You can change the firing rate. What What can I do? Which attribute to display? No Zen available. Okay, I, I can't. I can't make any upgrades to this weapon just yet. All right. Pick up some ammo. Some more ammo. How much do I have so far? Six seventy five. All right. I guarantee, with the amount of enemies that I've seen in this game so far, I'm probably gonna need a lot more. All right, we got any loot? down. Plus you're getting XP for all this mission item. Oh, this is where I had to go anyway. I got one of the control cores. I have to get two more, I think. Why does he look like that? I don't look like that no more. Okay, so let's go to the other one. I'm gonna I'm gonna circle around. Kind of explore a little bit. Now can I pull up now see when I press M it takes me right back to this is what I was talking about, the bird's eye view. I can't do anything yet because I just got through the tutorial. I have to find three cores to get it started. And then I think it I think it I don't know if it turns into a vehicle to move it somewhere else. Um I don't know what you do. But I'm curious how, how far will it let me go away? Okay, I've reached the border, I can't move. I just want to see how big the world is. Is it an open world or not? That's all I want to know. But it's post-apocalyptic. This is, uh, I think it's the year 2083, it said. Uh, this is after a nuclear uh, fallout. But uh, yeah, I've been working on changing a couple of jobs, but keeping it real as always and love tuning in to see notifications. Basically, it's like Command and Conquer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind of like Command and Conquer, but FPS uh, as well on top of that. Exactly. Good stuff, man. Yeah, keep up, keep up the work, dude. Working is... Uh, Important, you know, you got to pay the bills. I thought I saw something shiny down here. Where'd it go? Maybe not. Can I not run around in a circle around this area? Oh, can't go that way. Okay. Never mind. It, again, this might just be the starter area, so. The starter area we know now, because I just saw a boundary, is not open world. Alright. Um. Oh, they respond fast. They're not difficult, though. Not yet, at least. These guys only melee. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! <laughs> Wait a second, I had to reload, dude. Oh, that was me running. Losing my mind. I thought something was chasing me. Okay, let's go get the other two cores, and then we'll start up our base, I guess. Did that explode? I don't know. Okay.
70 meters. Okay, we're right next to one. We'll just go to this one first, and then we'll go hit that third over there. It looks like it's in a cave or something. A bunker system over here. Got some of the loot on this tank. Damage tank. Load shells? What? What? Can I shoot stuff? Where's an enemy? I'm just gonna shoot. Dude, can it move? It can't move. I wonder, it says damage tank. What if I find just a not damage tank? Will it be able to move around and fire? That's freaking cool, man. That's rad. All right, there's the other control core. We got one left. I'm just gonna try to be quicker. Got an energy bar. So there's there's food too. It's not just about cold. There's also food. Where, where's my hunger at? Or, 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 or health. Does like my health go down if I'm hungry? It'll tell me. It'll tell me. We'll figure it out later, guys. So there's survival mechanics. We know this for sure. We've seen cold and warm and uh, there's food. There's not food for no reason unless it's just for health. Um, actually, I'll, I'll find that out right now. Grants one of sated. Increase max HP. Yeah, it just increases max, max HP. So that's not... Not what I thought. But there is cold and warm. So there's some sort of survival aspect to it. Locker. Okay, well, I have a locker if there's nothing in there. Tease me like that. You can get some mech, uh, too, from what I've seen. What? Oh, that's rad. I saw a mech during the tutorial, but it was controlled by the, the AI. I thought it was only going to be AI controlled that I wouldn't be able to get into myself. That's sick. All right. Can we not climb the mountain? Where do you want? How do you want me to do this? How do I? Where do I go from here? All right, that's me right there. Do I have to go around? Oh, I have to go around. Okay. What? What do you want me to do? So not that way. There must be a tunnel that leads through the mountain somewhere. Before we move on. We are going to be picking up streams again. Just so you guys are aware too. Uh, I, 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 I've yet to find the perfect situation to where I'm able to stream stuff that is also going to be videos uh, and, and just keep my videos consistent while also keeping my streams consistent at the same time. But after this video that I've been working on for about a month uh, releases, if that content style works um, and, and it works for me on YouTube is, you know, I mean, I'm obviously I'm trying to grow <laughs> like it works as a growth uh, technique and it, it, it is good and fun. It'll, it'll, it's going to flow really, really well with, with uh, streams. So I'm, I'm going to try to stream as regularly as I can. And it's going to be a lot more uh, variety based rather than just one specific genre. You've obtained a Zint. This is what I was looking for. So this is how you like, it seems like customize your gun with different abilities. Modify your weapon. Yeah. So Q fires high speed Zen rounds. Okay. So that's now it, what, what it, it made it into a... So to get it, those are its abilities right there. It's not letting me go down to scroll to see it, but those must be the abilities. What's in here? Prototype weapon. Ayo! You son of a bitch. <laughs> this is a better gun, I think. No, it's the same gun? Standard core gun, basic core gun. Do they both have the same amount of damage? 32, 33. Standard core gun. Which one? Which one am I looking at here? Standard core gun has a little bit better, so we're we're just gonna switch over to that, I guess. I wish I would have used the uh, Zen on that though. That was stupid. Join the Discord. On join the Discord, and they hit uh, and they hit me up. Who hit you up? You talking about the, uh, the first Infinity Siege Discord? All modular parts and detachable weapons. No permanent structure. No fixed control circuitry. I can't believe they actually built this thing. But if you don't find a control core, 
This thing will be nothing but a heap of scrap. <sighs> One day, I'm gonna zip that bloody mouth of yours. Relax. It's a reverse jinx. Here My character's is. name is Faye? Post 11. Take care of her. I'll be taking up a defense position ahead. Night shift, death my life. Misery, there's nothing wrong with being on a night shift, man. You can go find a cool corner to toss one off to. Uh, go play test Delta Force in a few days and was impressed with extraction mode. Should be fun. Delta Force has an extraction mode? Delta Force. I think American Riot was playing that, my buddy. Maybe maybe I need to check that one out, too. Play test already over. Battlefield mode was pretty generic, but the other mode was fun for this game? Ah! Damn Jelly, you active on the Discord? I've been uh, their Discord for about six months, but I've not received anything. What, for this game? Yeah, they just emailed me the key and uh, told me to come check it out. I, 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 I didn't even know anything about it. Where are you going, dude? Come on, what's the stairs? Ain't even gonna get all the way up. Uh, I mean, you'll be able to play it. In, I mean, very shortly. It's released now. I mean, if you want to buy the game. You know what, Sammy? All right. Uh. You can open and close doors. Oh wait, no, no, no. There's actually stuff in here. <laughs> I was like, there's for no reason. There's actually stuff in there. All right, the other core was right here. What are you doing, bro? Explosive bolts will explode. Yeah, that makes sense. Place the control core inside the container and brace yourself for the coming onslaught. Oh boy. Delta Force will have extraction. It looks amazing. So, as in, you're, you're you're looting, you're finding equipment, and trying to get out with it and not die. I thought it was like a arena shooter. I did. I honestly, I know nothing about Delta Force. We'll have to look up uh, some gameplay on that before I get off tonight. Because on, I, I didn't know. I didn't know. If I knew that, I probably would have paid more attention to that game. What's the name of this? I missed it. It was multiplayer. Uh, yeah. So as far as I know, it's co-op. It's an RTS, so you have to build this this base, add defenses to it, but you can also do FPS. And you got to go around and loot and find supplies to build your base better and get ready for uh, massive attacks. The name of the game is Outpost Infinity Siege. It's on uh, Steam right now for 25 bucks. Crashing's an issue. You'll see mixed reviews on Steam, but it seems like they're mostly because of the crashing. Once they get that fixed, I mean, this is this is something that's unique. I've never played anything like it before. Oh, we gotta go back. I got all the course. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just sitting here talking to y'all. You guys know I do that sometimes. I just talk to chat and then forget what I'm doing in the game. I I, I am not. I've never been the best multitasker. Uh-uh. But who is? You extract items to unlock, upgrading your base and shooting range, stuff like that. What? When's the next? Is the plate test over? And when's the next one? I'm gonna have to look that up. Because I am working, the video I'm working on, that actually would kind of help to add that in there. Now, all of them. Done. Alright. We have all the stuff we need to activate our base now. I wonder if I were to kite one of the enemies over here, if my, my turrets would just start attacking it. I'm just curious if they just... You know what I mean? They just do it at random when, when I'm not in the middle of a combat scenario. Come on. Follow me. Let's go. All right, bub, you're up. Oh, yeah, they do. Nice. Do I get XP for that, too? Looks like I do. Oh, yeah. Nice. Y'all are dirty. Dirty, my dirty girls. Okay, uh, backpack. So put these in here. Boom, boom, boom. Activate the recovery procedure. How 
Now again, do I do that? Quick recovery, regular recovery. Oh boy. Well, I ain't got much ammo. Oh, I got an explosive bolt on this bad boy. We'll, we'll save it for like a boss if there's going to be one. I don't know. The, the top right corner must be... Top right corner must be like the waves. There must be four waves, I would imagine. Yeah, this first one's pretty easy. All right, let's try out one of these uh, explosive bolts. See how nasty they are. Let's hit that guy with the bomb back there. Not shoot it. Okay. Now let's see what you got. What? How do I not have any ammo? Dude, I just had like 165 rounds. How do I not have any ammo? All right, we gotta make some more. Dude. What is going on here? Estimated time, 300 seconds. What is going on, Faye? The control core just malfunctioned. Takes five minutes to reconfigure. I will deal with this wave. I can't. I don't have any ammo, you dummy. How am I supposed to fix this? All right. Well, it looks like I'm... Oh, my God. Am I going to have to run around and kick all of these? I'll just kick them all. <laughs> In better work this time. They're not even attacking me. They're just trying to move me out of the way to go for the base. I think that if they... Okay, they're attacking me. Never mind. I lied. Oh, sh look at that thing. How do I reload? I really don't get what I'm supposed to do here. I mean, I, I picked up ammo. Oh, you know what? I do remember what I'm supposed to do now. I have to place it down. All right, now we're cooking, y'all. Yep, I don't need to look at that. A machine gun mounted tower. Okay. That did nothing. Oh, we got him. Who are you? Artificial intelligence model Eden 9 at your service. I will aid you in the fight against SEAL. An AI to fight another AI? Requesting permanent control access for ease of battlefield operations. Do you consent? Uh... Did she say the fight against SEAL? Everything okay, Faye? Matt, like Kiss from a Rose? Something you should see. What's the hold up? You better get your ass moving before Levi What if Seal was the evil villain in this? One is now entering the battle. You're screwed. <laughs> I think he'd be a good villain. Man, I hear the last time Levi That's messed up. Like that was eight years ago, or so the rumors go. At least I have my own outpost now. The recovery fleet is on its way. Yeah, we're Deal gonna skip this. Pursuers. You might need to mop up a few How's the outpost to doing? get through. Remove the repair muzzle. Got it. Turn that down. It's too too much. Too much talking on me. Uh, and Delta Force will be like free to play also. Oh, I like that. Yo, player two, if you don't mind me asking, what's an average RPM you're getting on your channel at the moment? Revenue per milli? Oh my god, so low. But I'm fixing that. That's what that's what the now the whole next video that I'm working on is gonna fix that. It's about four to five dollars per thousand views. That's my RPM. Um, I don't know if it seemed like I was, it was good in a good, it, it was in a good state other than stuff that needed translation. Yeah. You went to YouTube now? I've been on YouTube. I stream on YouTube and Twitch. I just did, this stream was uh, working with the developer. They, they, I'm collaborating with these guys to uh, put the stream up today. So I'm only doing it on YouTube today. Shoot out beams that can repair outpost components and support units. Ooh, outpost healing beam. I like that. That's cool. Why do you fight against seal? Oh, I could take the turret off, dude. I cannot override it. Hold on. I didn't know I could take it off.
Did it repair? I don't think I'm repairing the right thing. That is so cool. This is such a cool little concept right here. For the past few days, I've been nervous about you being Craft ammo. Okay, can I drop this? Right to be wary of AIs. My presence should not be made public as of now. How do I drop this? You sure know a lot. Okay, crafted more ammo, good. Healing cannon right there, reload, okay. So I gotta reload that cannon. Reload. All right, he's, he's ready to rock. This game is a RTS slash FPS. So tower defense kinda, Who made you? but also FPS. Aren't you curious? Please, define curious. Um, it's the feeling you get. Faye, the recovery fleet is nearing your position. We are only recovering the control core this time. I've already given them the heads up. However, Why am I doing this? Exploration days, you'll have to confirm the recovery items yourself. Gather yeah, powers to give me power, I think. This guy just threw a tantrum, and now he's acting like nothing happened. Is that it? Wait for further instruction. Got it. Enter command mode from your wristband. Okay. In command mode, you can deploy support facilities and control them during combat. The Titan Spike can enhance the output of the core tower, boosting the turret damage. It may also Titan be switched spike. to offensive mode to electrocute nearby enemies. Titan, build a Titan Spike. Where I didn't see the Titan Spike. Where is it at? Is this it right here? Titan Spike provides core output and expands X. Okay, okay, okay. Where do I put it at? It does it not matter. Does it matter where I put it? Um, I'm gonna put it right here, I guess. Oh, this is gonna get. There's gonna be so much building in this game. I guarantee it's just. It's gonna get. It's gonna become a cluster. And if you start losing pieces of it during a uh, defense, when when you have all the enemies attacking you, it's everything will kind of snowball. So I want to make sure I put it in a good spot where that doesn't happen. How many do they want me to build? Two. All right, put one over there, and I guess I don't know one over here. Stake walls. What are they for? The mechanos will mindlessly attack all defensive structures near the outpost. Stake walls not only draw enemy fire, they also damage enemies that come in contact with them. Okay, so these are my walls. Alright, alright. I wanna link them up. Can I... There's no snapping? Snapping would be nice. Is there snapping? It doesn't seem like there is. About as close as it's gonna get. Alright, we'll do... Can I... Oh, it's not gonna be perfect, but it'll be alright. Well, that one was right on the edge of that one, so we'll we'll do we'll do it kind of like that, matching. So right here. Should be more than capable of handling the upcoming attack. Here. Great. Outpost eleven to recovery fleet. Defenses are all set. You can begin your work now. Combat mode activated. What's up, Ted? Hold your ground until the recovery is complete. Okay. We got some walls. And we got some balls. I'm, I, I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid at all. Wow, that was way too much rhyming. Oh, yeah, you gotta hit the bomb on his back. Kill so many of them when you do that. Oh, this is way too easy. It'll get harder, but this, this, 
Use it. Just hit. Just hit the bomb, guy is Really, all you got to do, at least from the FPS perspective. I always stream YouTube, Ted. I do usually Twitch and YouTube at the same time. Just today, I'm just doing YouTube. Yeah, this isn't really that difficult yet. <laughs> they're, they're 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 taking forever to get to me. I would have had a lot of challenge. I'd like to see their. I'd like to see how challenging it can get. Oh, let that roll down. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Oh, come on. Hit it! Hit the bomb! What? Oh, now they're getting closer. Oh! Uh-oh. I don't have any more ammo. I gotta go make more ammo. I spoke to, I might have spoke too soon. They're already taking down my walls and killing some things. This is not good. Damn. Shoot him, shoot him. Do any of these need to be reloaded? Because these guys aren't even firing. They probably do have to be reloaded. Oh, I don't have an ammo box. Okay, 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 okay. We can go make another one then. I think I have enough for another one. Can I make another one? Can't. 54 seconds. Shit. Go! Light him up! There you go, there you go, there you go. Oh no. The artillery pieces on the ridge are helping us. Those are artillery positions left from the pre-war era. I have brought them under our control. You may now issue them with commands. Ooh! You never cease to amaze me. It's time for some payback. That's sick. Okay, let's let's drop in and do that then. Uh, bam, right here. I don't. How do I? I'm pressing Z. How do I use it? How do how do I how do I use it? Hold on. It said to press Z, but I'm I'm pressing Z and nothing's happening. I think it's working. Oh my god, these dudes are not playing around. Got to level up out of that, too. There's only 99 of them left. Fifty five. I think we got this. They're done. That's it. 17? Where are they? Oh, they're right there. Although I'll go away if you get the guy in the back. Get the guy in the back! I have no ammo left. It won't even let me shoot it. It says 5 out of 0, but it won't even let me shoot it. That's so weird. Stocking up. Let's get out of here. This is Faye, calling any available transport. 
Helen Dubois. What a what a fancy name. You can kiss your commander career goodbye. Levi, I was only trying to Outpost 8 and 10 have also eliminated enemy reinforcements. Your way out is clear. Take outpost 11 home, Faye. Good work today. See you at the base. Yes, sir. Wait, so is that a form of exfil? I'm very, I'm very confused now. So I am just leaving my base there after all. Or outpost. Oh, it does move. I told you. I think those were like wheels that were coming up or tracks or something. Tour complete. Okay. Believe in yourself. Leave. You have just broken the recovery record, Bay. Okay. Nah, skip it. Skippy, skip, skip. It's not let me skip. Nope. This game, uh, yeah, it's a little wild. A little, it's different. It's different for sure. I think that the further you get into the game, when it actually gets more difficult to hold them back, I think it'll be a lot of fun. If there's different weapons, hopefully there's different weapons. I, I hope it's not the same, just assault rifle the whole time that would get a little old after a journey across half the continent this place or better be amazing if they can add it later you should be thankful this place looks decrepit it's the only way the underground infrastructure managed to evade any unwanted mechano's attention we put the equipment here to good use only took us three years to can i skip i can't skip three Base core. This is like the biggest. This is like it seems like the big base. But I'm still I'm still not entirely sure whether whether this is a open world survival tower defense FPS game because I mean you're, you're still going out and I have to like, go find all these different uh, materials to build up my base and I don't know if that's going to be like a standard. You go in for a match because now I, I just X filled. But I, but I, I don't know. I don't know if it's a match-based thing now. I'm very, I'm very confused and still very intrigued about what this game actually is. Go to Nexus. So it says main missions. We, we're probably gonna find out here. What's up? Can I talk to you? What's up, Roland? Terminating communication without permission during an engagement. You've got some explaining to do. I was. Next time. Yeah. That's going to be a no for me, dog. <laughs> Let's go up here and see what these people have to say. Is third division still dark? Yeah. I'm going to skip all that. Go to, go to barracks. Okay, how do I get there? Base terminal? Barracks is up there. It's kind of far. Okay. Is there... Is this an elevator? Oh, it is. Okay. My dude, I've been watching you for a while. Please play Hell Divers. I am. It is going to be in not the second, the, the first video I have coming up on Sunday, but the one after that. I guarantee you're going to love it. I just played it for the first time, and uh, it, it's a part of the bigger video. It'll be about an hour and a half video, biggest thing I've, I've done so far. Very excited about it. No! Oh my god. I didn't know. How was I supposed to know it was going to make me turn around? Cool. Now let's can we go back up again? Jeez. But it was awesome. Wow. I, I played Hell Divers for the first time three days ago, and oh my god, how have I not? How did it take me so long? The whole vibe is just immaculate. I know everybody was already telling me that. They kind of got a similar thing going on here, but it's like Starship Troopers the game, except better. I, I, I don't know any other way to put it. It's fantastic. SN if it you may visit the supply depot within the barracks. Gears grant defense and provide. Oh, no, that's going too fast for me to read. Okay. Uh, your backpack space. Nope. I'm not even going to try anymore. That should do it. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> head, head to the windy desert and recover a turret barrel. Okay. Tour mode. 
I am perturbed. I do not understand the, the objective now. I am very... I, I really don't. Tour mode. So I'm going to go on tour. Commander of Outpost 11, Faye Pratt. The control Please pad has been deployed to your command terminal. You will be able to control Outpost 11 through it. When you dispatch your outpost, you will need to issue missions and commands here. Okay. Okay, so I'm in construction mode. I can add windows. I can add ladders. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. So before I even go out into the world with, with it, I can, I can add all this stuff. That's really cool. Especially if you're a builder person. I like to build things sometimes. All right, what what what, what all do, can I even make? Nothing. I need increase the core output. Okay. Material load decrease max resources. How do how do how am I able to build it then? Zero out of twenty. It, yeah, connection bonus. That's the connection bonus. That's not how I get it. How do I get materials? Materials used for crafting items, deploying facilities and units. Okay. Needed for outpost traversal, activating functions, and making your exploration easier in various occasions. Okay. Or outpost. Boost all turret damage expenses. Okay. So... Can I can I add more walls? Is that is that what I want to do here? How do I add an armored wall? What, what, what will this connect to? Oh! Okay, I added a wall. Let's add more walls. Rotate. I can't make them anymore. Well, cool, I got two more walls. Very cool. Save and exit, yes. All right. Confirm. Operative. Okay. Do I have another choice? Nope. Faye is the only option. Okay. And he has different abilities that the others probably don't have. What am I got? What's up, Millets and Minded? How you doing, man? All right. So I got an adaptive armor in my backpack. How do I put that on? Put it in my vest. So that increases my attack and my defense. And then basic core gun. Now I have the standard core gun. Can I like sell it? Oh, of course I can. Cool, sell that shit. I got some Zen. Booster minimally increases damage. Can I put that on this gun? All right, I should be able to. And then I got some energy bars out here. I guess that's for health, maybe. I'm not entirely sure. And then I have armor plates. Also not sure where that goes. You can add a sight to the gun. Barrel changes under barrel stock. Okay, confirm. Sure, let's Please go in the world and see what happens. Okay, so we're in the windy desert. It seems like it's all pretty close. This is hard. This is locked. I mean, this is all we can really go to right now. Enemy power is a thousand. Can I at least see what the others say? No. Okay. I get miners collecting resources will appear during recovery day. Okay. Cool. Please confirm operation. All right. There's so many buttons. Just, just go to the game. Tactical map. Okay. Commander Fay, your sortie order has been received. I will now go over the mission details. This here is a base station. It will provide power to the outpost. It features an active Promethean field to prevent lock-on from the Aitos. I don't even know what we're saying. You're speaking Chinese right now. It's task for exploration day. Please select a route to begin the search routine. Uh, start will inevitably attract the attentions of the Mechanos. So you must not linger nor backtrack your search. Be prepared. While the outpost I did something. I don't know what I did, but I did something. Uh, we'll find out. 
dude yeah when you get your back your outpost to be that big with those massive walls like that that's that's gonna be awesome if they start like trying to climb the walls that would be really cool day two 11 hour sunny all right Faye, this is your first run with outpost 11. it's exploration day i don't want Go to out there to gather valuable items and transport them back to the base i've marked out all pois for you copy that So it does want me to extract? Hold up. Is this an extraction shooter then? I'm so confused now. Hold on, if that's the case. I wanna get some footage of this game. <laughs> Outside of what I'm doing. Oh, they're not even paying attention to me. I thought the others were going to come after me as soon as I started firing at one of them. Guess not. You're, you're right there, bro. Are they inside? I see red dots on the mini map. Oh my God. All right. Okay. So there's jump scares. I, <laughs> I guess. What are you guys doing? Oh, they're coming. Okay. Dang. That was way more intense than it ever needed to be. Where's he at? I hear him running around. He must be up above me. There's no loot. Oh, there it is, right there. Oh, I got a grenade. How do I how do I throw grenades? It's probably G. Yep. All right. I thought I died. At least I didn't die. How do I? Is he above me? He has to be above me. He has to be up here, right? How do I get up there? Stairs right here? No. That's about it for that. Let's unlock this cabinet. Component region. We got a mechanical part. Cool. Energy bar. So, yeah, guys, with looting, completing a mission, defending your base, and then ex exfilling. I guess you have to survive to get out with all that stuff. You have to survive the onslaught. This is kind of an RTS FPS extraction shooter. What? <laughs> Multi-purpose sight. Okay, that's nice. Let me let me go and put that on my my gun right quick. If if that's if I'm if I'm correct in what I'm saying, if that's the case, that's crazy. Ooh, I like this one. Do I have any more ammo? What am I doing? Oh, I just ate a protein bar. Okay. Do I have any... I don't have any ammo? I need to go back to the base. Rad extract. Yes. Get that rad source. Whatever that is. Sophia, I've hidden useful items. The switch is nearby. Okay. Component. We got some gunpowder. Pick up. Ooh, got some Zen material. Those are good for upgrading your guns. Yo, c -Rex, what's up, man? What game is this? This is called uh, Star Siege. This game is called Outpost Infinity Siege. Star Siege, whole different game. Okay, that should be good for that. We might have to get one more set, but we have 50 seconds left, so I can do that. Is this where this wants me to put this? These items will be recovered and stored in the field storage. Okay. I guess that's understood then. How do I switch what's in my hotbar? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Is it hold F? Hold G. No, I'm just keep eating candy bars. This is not what I wanted. I don't remember how... Oh, tab. Tab it was. Let's get our ammo back up. But yeah. Cool concept. 
I'd like to see a little bit more um, engagement. Like, you know what I mean? I'd like to see more difficulty when I'm running around here looting like this. The, the AI are nothing. I mean, they're... Oh, my God! Every time I say... Every time I say that, this has happened to me. I think I peed a little. All right. What the hell? Hey, man, chill. I kind of want to die and see what happens if I die, like if I lose everything. What do you mean rest in peace, Star Siege? That game isn't dead, is it? I mean, it's like, it's a dead game, but I mean, it's not dead. Like it's still, the servers are still up, right? I hope so, because I'm working on a, oh, blue, well, perfect. I told I told you earlier, I was working on a, uh, I'm working on a video that would need me to play it, but I might have to have some people get on with me. <laughs> If, if there's nobody in the servers, then I'm, I'm, I might have to just have some people get on and then I'll be able to be able to play it. Locker. What's in the locker? Uh, fiber and gunpowder. Cool. Projection module shoots the item. Couldn't read that. Tire. What does that give me? It's who, is that is that increasing that bottom left bar? No, something else is increasing that bottom bar. I have no idea what I'm grabbing out of here. There's something over here. Explore POI. Activate the recovery procedure. I got some polymer. I don't know if that's from the, the car or not, though. I mean, the, the tires or not. Although they stopped development for it. They may have stopped development for it, but I, I got on it the other day and it let me get on. I, I don't know if you could get into a match, though. I haven't tried to get into a match. But they probably did stop development. I mean, the game died. I mean, there was literally, like, nobody was playing it. it and what's crazy is, the beta for it, terrible. But when the game launched, I guess it would be early access. Kind of fun. I, I actually had a pretty good time playing it. So this is my search area, so I don't really have much much further I can go than this. Okay. So you've reached your border and can't move out of bounds. So then how how would I how would I go further again? This thing moves, right? Activate the recovery. So we'll, we'll activate the recovery procedure and then I'll find out if it moves or not. But even if Star Siege is gone, I mean, dude, there's so many other good extraction shooters that are not only out right now that I've discovered while doing research for this video that I'm doing, but also uh, coming at some point soon, hopefully. I, I wish one of those big ones, though, man, would finally come out, right? Like, we've been talking about Marathon, Arc Raiders, Division Heartland, and uh, uh, PUBG's one, Pro Project Black Budget, for like a year, dude. Like, it's been it's been long enough. Although somebody just came in the chat earlier and told me to check out uh, Delta Force. I didn't know it was an extraction shooter. Otherwise, I would have probably been more uh, intrigued. Projection module. This must be what it's asking for. Regular recovery. Okay. Yes. Oh, shit. Now I got to defend it. I didn't know that's what I was doing. I keep forgetting that's what it does. I need to have ammo out here. I don't even have any guns. Wait a second. I don't, I don't have any, I don't have any, uh, it, it, I don't have any, uh, turrets. Interact with the core to end, end exploration. Oh, wait, I'm okay. Exploration complete. That, that was an extraction, right? Can we agree? Uh, I think it'll have a mode. Somebody said that, yeah, so they said that it, it so it has different modes. What is, like, the core gameplay of the game? I'm so confused, though. But also, warfare mode, story mode, it's trying to do it all. Yeah. I don't know about that. Do you feel confident about that? Like, I feel like when, ga when games spread themselves thin and, and just try to do everything and be everything they can be, it ends up making the game feel kind of empty because nothing gets enough love. Internal power cycle. During this tour period for each kill on a, an enemy by hitting with their weak... I'm having an aneurysm. What, what's, what, what does that say? During this tour period, for each kill on an enemy, 
by hitting their weak point, building material plus five. Okay, I, I think I get that. Each kill with the X boost field gives you gold, max HP. There's so many things. There's so many like numbers and maxes and boosts and enemy. It's going to take a while to understand this. Enemy have higher defense when outside. Okay, select an incident reward. I think I'm going to do alchemy. That sounds cool. There are enemy scouts everywhere and a whole army of enemies prepared to attack. They're waiting for a signal, which is when we go to recover the key object. Okay. Heading for the target area. Okay, so it's like a sto the tour mode is a story. It's this is like a story mode, I'm guessing. They probably have another mode then for like just straight up base defense. Like zombies Remember, mode, if you will. If you're outnumbered, come right back to your outpost. The weapons will take care of them. I don't even have any, I don't think. Do I? No, I don't even have any weapons. <laughs> I need to put some weapons down, son. Uh let's put down core tower I already have that ammo maker small Jenny I don't even have them so what turrets are you talking about dude they're not gonna shoot shit there's nothing to shoot he's lying to me I don't think there's fall damage yeah yeah I think they got it set up like duty yeah that's my point <laughs> case in point Call of Duty was so good at one, maybe two things for the longest time. Now they're everything. So it's just kind of when you turn it on and you go through that menu system of Call of Duty now, which I had to do the other day because I tried zombies for the first time. I was trying to get some footage and uh, man, it's just it's just yelling at you. It just yells at you the whole time in your face. Like a like a TikTok brain. 12 year old that's like doing like dance like like famous dances and twerks it, it, it just yells in your face the whole time it was too much for me to handle I don't I don't have any expectation for it really yeah I'm kind of that way with a lot of the games right now there's really nothing like gray zone warfare obviously has me intrigued but seeing the gameplay that I saw, I still think that a lot of the stuff that they've talked about the game having and being could be far away. And when they go into early access, it's still, it still has a while to go before it's the game that we want. And the, the problem when that happens is some games never make it to the point and stay live long enough to, to add the stuff. Star Siege is a great, like, point of what I'm talking about. They just, they never get to the point to add all the stuff they talked about. Um, so hopefully that's, hopefully that's not the case, but you know what I mean? I, I, I could, I mean, games have done it before and it's happened a lot. So I hope that that's, I hope that doesn't happen. Seems like DMZ is blah now. Yeah. Nobody plays DMZ anymore. I mean, they probably do, but you know, there's there's some 12 year old in Pakistan. Nobody plays DMZ anymore. Although I played that too the other day. I think you're starting to understand what my video I'm working on is. Uh, yeah. Also, okay, yeah, okay. Are you coming for me? The AI definitely needs a little bit of work. Uh, they're not super responsive, so I'd like to, I'd like to see them increase their lethality. I mean. I understand they could kill me pretty quickly, but they they, they kind of just run, you know, do the little basic jog towards you type thing. The in, the indie game AI jog thing where it's not too fast, not too slow, and it's not really that dangerous or engaging. I'd love to see them add add some more stuff to that. The, the concept so far, though, is weird, man. I, I've never played anything of this nature. It definitely has extraction elements. It has RTS, uh, command and conquer type elements. FPS, it's very different. Also PVP, personally, I'd like to see, even though that rhymes. I activated a Titan spike.
Make sure you're ready for a fight before beginning recovery. Okie dokie. Thanks for reminding me because I would have forgot again. Appreciate it. General or whatever. Oh. Okay, so I can have a tie key card. You can have key cards to access these or you can just use power. All right, well, I want to see what's in there now. Some ammo, some ammo. If it's only ammo in here, I'm going to be pissed. Okay, some scrap metal. What else do we have in here? Turret Nexus. The core of the automatic turret, an indispensable part of it. Cool. Okay. Oh, backpack fool. That's not good. Well, let's, uh, let's see. We got some scrap metal in here. Uh, how many slots are the thing you need to take up? Basic materials. So I want to get most of this stuff back. Let's put that there. Put that. What are you doing? Put that there. Should be able to fit in there, right? Yep. Okay. Ooh. Weapon part. Hold. Mass produced gun barrel. Okay, I think I can just throw that on my gun, right? Yeah, let's just let's just equip it. How do I drop it? Let's do equip. So now I got a longer barrel. Nice. Oh, there's another door. What's behind here? Bro, no, you don't get to do that. You don't get to do that. I just paid power, which is apparently an important resource, to go out of the room that I was in back into nothing. So that didn't get me anything new. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm so mad right now. <laughs> That's so stupid. Like if I'm already in there, you have to have an unlock feature. It just, it should just say unlock on the on the outside. That makes me so mad. Uh, yeah, the AI showed on Kingmakers is way more combative than this. Okay, okay. Well, I'll have to check out Kingmakers as well. I think, uh... I think there's a lot of games that, that have... have my attention right now. It's hard to pay attention to all of them. Well, where's the other enemies? How far can I go down here? What you doing there, guys? Y'all big chillin'? What you trying to say? You trying to grab me? That ain't gonna happen. Please stay there the whole time. Nope. At least he does that. Because there's a lot of games I play where they just sit there and run right at you. And they just can't figure out how to get past the barrier. At least they have a... Uh, game design that allows them to do that. Saw a little leak of Arc Raiders the other day, and man, the AI is wild. Really? Is it new gameplay? Because, I mean, it looked pretty decent when I saw it, you know, last year, but I, uh, I, I when, when, when it's a closed, where you're not, we're under NDA, and you're not able to, like, talk about it, it's like, I just don't care to play it, so I haven't even played their, their beta they had prior. Same thing with Division Heartland, I just don't, I don't care. If you're not gonna let me talk to people about it, then I'm not I'm not really that interested. Don't do that. Don't do that. I know this has probably been asked a few times, what game is this? It has, but I didn't put it in the title, so you're not wrong. The game is Outpost Infinity Siege. It's an RTS, like Command and Conquer type deal, but also FPS and an and Xfil game, because after I get done with this area, I have to uh Extract, I guess, survive to extract. I don't know. It's very weird. It's hard to explain. It's on Steam right now for 25 bucks. It needs some work. It has uh, some crashing errors. I haven't had one. I only had one at the beginning. Uh, the AI is a little wonky, but I can see there being some difficulties when you get up into the higher levels, and I think it, I think it's a game worth investing some time into. I mean, I'm having fun with it, and I mean, it's in its state that it's currently in, so. Alright. Leave that there. Reload them and they'll be ready to use. W I wish I could do that. MG turrets nearby. Oh! Okay, 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 okay. I get it. Now. MG turrets are reliable, but their ammo reserves are limited. 
and need to be reloaded can I reload them from here that would be way better if I could just do that that's that's gonna be a no that's the only one place MG turret barrel into the container okay oh that's what I've been having to do this whole time it says in the top right I'm losing my mind guys it is cool it, it, it is pretty cool it's it's unique which is important because so many games are the same thing over and over again today but uh this one actually has an interesting design it's different I haven't played anything I can't compare it to anything there's nothing like this turret nexus I put that in there too let's do our recovery I guess now there's going to be the base defense we get a ammo box I'm going to need that make another one okay Is that it? I can leave right now. It says I can leave, but I wonder what happens if I stay. I think we're... Really? Okay. Okay. The general way oversold that one. <laughs> he, said, he said I better make sure I'm prepared before I hit recovery. There's like 30 of them. That wasn't bad at all. Okay. Let's end exploration. What does an area scan do? Hold on. Oh. Oh, I missed a lot of stuff. Well, I'm glad that I did that. Oh, is that all I did? It doesn't stay up the whole time? Oh my god, so I missed out on that. Whatever. Valuables. Scrap metal. Projection module, a lock pick. Oh, I'll probably gonna use that a grenade. What do I have in my hand? Polymer, ammo, ammo, which we can now. We don't need. We don't need that now. So, if I need to make room in my backpack, which I, I guarantee I'm going to, then I will. Basic material. I throw that. All right. Zen chest. Nice. Slightly increases radius. Uh, of what? Material starting device to envoy generator capable of producing massive currents. What, if I shoot it, is that what happens? No. How do you, how do you use it then? Hold on. Use item. I'm holding and, and using it. It's just making me do a kick, so that's not true. Maybe it's a Griff Ball from Halo. Uh, what's this then? This is Star... Nope. Oh, there was a key card the whole time. I didn't even have to use my power. Outpost uh, Infinity Siege. It's on Steam. Uh, just launched today. Is that all? I think that's everything here, guys. Uh, this big bot they showed in the trailer jumped almost the map and looks inside and just laser beams a player inside a dome building. But in this game? I know that the enemies are just going to get bigger and tougher. I know, I'm, I'm expecting that for sure. Let me go check over here before we dip. Oh, glad I did. I don't know what that is. Electromagnetic plug enables you to Stop cutting me off, man. I couldn't even read what it told me to do. Oh, wait. Wait a second. Wait a second. What do I plug this? Uh, how far does it go? Ooh, I feel like I'm stretching them thin. <laughs> that generator's over there. Like, ooh, 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 yeah. he's, he's, he's not. He's not. He's not feeling it. What do I plug it into? Wait a second, do I plug it into the ball that I just had? Or where do I, maybe, maybe it goes all the way to the top up there. I can't remember what it told me to do. Material enables you to transfer pulse energy via a connection. Okay. Okay. What do you want me to do? I feel like this looks like it would go in there. Does it not? Like it just sit on top of it? It's an electromagnetic, electromagnetic plug and this is electro orbs. 
which you're the starting device to avoid generator capable of producing massive currents. So that should go in there, right? I'm pressing the use button and it's doing this. Press E to confirm. Yes. Yes. I'm pressing it, man. I don't know. Guys, I don't know. I don't know what to do here. What's the aim of the game, dude? Uh, So you're trying to get... It's kind of an extraction game. Shoot. <laughs> You're going into these areas and you loot, you kill the enemies in the area, you find, you know, new resources, you build your base bigger and better, and you go back, and then at the end of usually every single one of these, you have a massive base attack and all these creatures and uh, robots or whatever come after you. And then you gotta survive that. And then you're, you're able to exfil back into your base and go to like the huge, huge base with all the humans at it. And you know repair and upgrade and whatever. All right, I think that's I think that's everything in here. I'm I'm I'm, I'm kind of done with this spot. Let's go ahead and extract. I like the game visuals. They approve the AI. I think this would be uh, good. Yeah, 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 dude. Yeah, the visuals are fine. I agree. Cool. Tactical map. Yes. Interact. <laughs> Amp kill during this tour period. Oh yeah. All right. So these are different. These are different uh, objectives that you can you can select. Basically, like debuffs. That if if you choose one of the debuffs or, or buffs rather, it's like a a better way to put it would be a game multiplier. It's like these are like game multipliers. They change the way the match is going to run. Uh, but give up. Yeah, I don't want to do that. So. It's, it's almost like, I think, a story mode, kind of? They call it tour mode, but you're going around all these different locations and extracting from them. I, I still don't understand the overarching idea, what like what the goal is, what, what you're trying to achieve by doing this. I mean, you get a bigger base, but I, I don't I don't know what, what I'm competing for, what I'm what I'm completing. So this is the, the base, the interior. But yeah. Honestly, pretty pretty solid, cool game. I got a lot of work left. I gotta I gotta focus on tonight, um, so I'm gonna be cutting it down there. I appreciate you guys hanging out and playing this. Well, watch, watching me play this tonight. Uh, I have big plans coming up. I've been MIA for a reason. I've been MIA just because I've just been chilling. I have one video that's gonna be releasing on Sunday, which is gonna be a little bit smaller, about 30 minutes or so long of this new content style that I'm kind of working on that I think I I believe in my gut it is the best thing that I've ever made and it is going to do so well and it'll be the future of what I start to do now I don't want to really want to get too much into it because it'd be hard to explain and uh but the bigger one that I've been really working on for for about a good the good part of the month is about an hour and a half video and uh, same type of concept except it's much longer more in depth and uh it will be based that one will be based around extraction shooters every single one of them so I, it's going to be a lot of fun i can't wait for that to come out the first one will be on sunday uh it'll not be extraction shooter based but it will be fps based and uh that's all i got once we get that on the road with the new content i i will likely be getting back into a schedule of streaming i'd like i always wanted to stick to a schedule and just it, it, it was so hard when you when you were trying to figure out what type of video you want to do and uh, what type of content video wise to do and then also do streams it, it, it never flowed the way it was supposed to and I think that I can get it to flow this way because I love doing this you guys know this is my favorite part of the whole content thing anyway just hanging out and playing games with you guys uh, I'm gonna have a go dude try it you might like it it's 25 bucks not too bad uh, try it for two hours I mean you can always refund I guess give it a shot that's it for me guys i gotta get out of here i definitely gotta go eat dinner because i am starving uh have a good one peace guys